German courier is carrying important official documents, murdered on train from Oran. Murderer and possible accomplices headed for Casablanca. thousand francs in cash. Remember, in cash. I'll never get out of here. I'll die passively. Perhaps tomorrow we'll be on the plane. Some of them have been waiting years for a visa. An occupied France welcomes you to Casablanca. Angel Captain, it's very good to be here. Where have you the murder of the couriers? What has been done? You know already who the murderer is. Good. Is he in custody? Tonight he'll be at Rick's. Everybody comes to Rick's. Somewhere I've seen him. Captain, the boy was playing the piano. 
came from Paris with Rick. Rick was he? No matter that he's the kind of man that, well, if I were a woman and I were not around, I should be in love with Rick. I should be in love with Rick. I should be in love with Rick. Well, if I were a woman, well, if I were a woman, I should be in love with Rick. Uh, excuse me, may I present Major Heinrich Strasser? This is hardly the time or the place. This time they really need to stop me. He's under the visible man. Rick! Don't tell me! Rick! Rick! He's arrested here tonight. Could you ask the piano of to come over here, please? Hello, sir. Hello, Miss Elsa. I never expect to see you again. It's been a long time. Where is Rick? I don't know. I ain't seen him all night. He used to be a much better liar, sir. Leave them alone for themselves. You bad luck to them. Play it once, Sam. For all time's sake, play it, Sam. Play as time goes by. You must be remembered. A kiss is just a kiss. A sigh is just a sigh. Sam, I thought I told you never to play.
when you come to that moment you were here. Can I tell you a story? It's about a girl who had just come to Paris from her home in Oslo. She met a man about whom she'd heard her whole life. A very great and courageous man. And she looked up to him. Who was it you left me for? Was it Laszlo or were there others in between? Aren't you the kind that tell? I strongly suspect that you got to lift the letters of transit with Mr. Blaine. I would suggest you search the cafe immediately and thoroughly. So you're an escape prisoner of the Reich. So far you have been fortunate enough in eluding us. You have reached Casablanca. Uh, by the way, Monsieur, last night you evinced an interest in Senor Yugatti. Senor Yugatti's dead. I'm only a poor corrupt official. I have no conviction, if that's what you mean. I blow in the wind. This is a job for Senor Ferrari. Ferrari? It can be most helpful to know Senor Ferrari. He currently has a monopoly on the black market here. Oh, right. Uh, good morning, Rick. I have a drink with you. I'll have a drink in the morning. I'll have a drink in the morning. I'll have a drink in the morning. What upsets me is the fact that your guy is dead. No one knows where those letters of transit are. Practically no one. You're the only one I trust. Will you keep these for me, please? Thank you, I knew I could trust you. Nick, I put my cards on the table. I think you know where those letters are. Molly, Senor Ferrari, the fat gent at the table. I'm sorry I was in no condition to receive you when you called on me last night. We knew very little about each other when we were in love in Paris. If we leave it that way, maybe we'll remember those days, not Casablanca. No, you see, Victor Lazar is my husband. And was, even when I knew you in Paris. We were just hearing Monsieur Lazar, but unfortunately I'm not able to help you. We've decided, Signor Ferrari. For the present, we go on looking for two excuses. Thank you very much. Have you heard about Signor Gaffi, the letters of transit? Yes, something. You know where they are? But for sure, Monsieur. I'll venture to guess that the guard he left those letters with Miss Yogi. Rick, have you got those letters of transit? The subject is closed. Monsieur Blaine, I wonder if I could talk to you in my office. Right. Are you enough of a businessman to appreciate an offer of 100,000 francs? My friend, you could make it a million francs at three. My answer would still be the same. Wait. Excuse to close it. Fine one. Everybody is to leave here immediately. This cafe is closed until further notice. I'm shocked, shocked to find that gambling is going on in here. You're winning, sir. Oh, thank you very much. Everybody out at once. I'm only a poor corrupt official. I have no conviction, if that's what you mean. I blow in the wind. Victor, why don't you tell me one quick? What did you find out? Apparently he has the business. Yes. But no intention of selling them. But I was in a concentration camp. I'm the only cause I'm interested in. I wouldn't bring up 
Paris if I were you with poor salesmanship. You want to feel sorry for yourself, don't you? I'm sorry, but, but you you are our last hope. If you don't help us, Victor Lazar will die in Casablanca. How have you? I tried everything, now I want those letters. Go ahead and shoot. You'll be doing me a favor. You knew how much I loved you. How much I still love you. Then? It wasn't long after we were married that Victor went back to Czechoslovakia. I was frantic. For months I tried to get word. Then it came. He was dead, shot, trying to escape. Then I met you. And when did you first find out he was alive? Just before you and I were ready in Paris together. A friend came and told me that Victor was alive. I'm hiding him in the freight car in the outskirts of Paris. I don't know what's right any longer. You have to think for both of us. All right. I will. Just looking at you, kid. And you sometimes wonder if it's worth all this? I mean, what you're fighting for. So fighting our enemies, the world will die. Or whatever. And it'll be out of its misery. You know how you saw Mr. Blaine? Like a man who's trying to convince himself of something he doesn't believe in his heart. I wonder if you know that you're trying to escape from yourself. It's perhaps a strange circumstance. We both should be in love with the same woman. I knew there was something between you and Ilsa. You won't give me the letters of transit. All right. I want my wife to be safe. Use the letters to take her away from Casablanca. I love her that much. Yes, I love her that much. Mr. Laszlo? Yes? You'll come with us. We have a warrant for your arrest. It seems that destiny has taken a hand. By any chance you were to help him to escape. What makes you think I'd stick my neck out for Laszlo? You've got the letters of transit now. Don't bother to deny it. You'll count too much on my friendship, Ricky. In this matter, I'm powerless. I'm only a poor corrupt official. I have no conviction, if that's what you mean. I blow in the wind. I should be in love with Ricky. Yes, I have the letters. I intend using them myself. I'm leaving Castle Black on tonight's plane, the last plane. Taking a friend with me, one you appreciate. Our friend, Elsa Run. Maybe I'll make a deal with you. Instead of this petty charge you have against him, you can get something really big, something that would chuck him in a concentration camp for years. Then release him. It'll be at my place a half an hour before the plane. I'll arrange to have Laszlo come there to pick up the letters of transit, and that'll give you the criminal grounds on which to make the arrest. Ah, to get out of Casablanca and go to America. But a lucky man. Well, so long. I was informed just as last I was about to leave the hotel. So I knew I'd be on time. Is everything ready? I have the letters right here. Oh, here they are. Better wait in my office. Victor thinks I'm leaving with him. Haven't you told him? No, not yet. Please trust me. Good. I've got the letters right here, all made out in blank. All you have to do is fill in the signatures. Victor Laszlo? Victor Laszlo, you're under arrest. Oh, you're surprised about my friend Ricky. The explanation is quite simple. Now, it seems as triumph over virtue. Thank you. Nobody's going to be arrested, not for a while yet. Oh yeah, I wouldn't like to shoot you, but I will. If you take one more step, can you call the airport and let me hear you tell them? And remember, this gun is pointed right at your heart. That is my least vulnerable spot. I'm only a poor corrupt official. I have no conviction, if that's what you mean. I blow in the wind. Is that the airport? Huh? This is Captain Reynolds speaking. There were two letters of transit for the Lisbon plane. Hello? Hello? I can't make it. Have a squad of police meet me at the airport upon us. Will you have your man go with Mr. Lazlo and take care of his luggage? Certainly, Rick. Anything you say. Buy Mr. Lazlo's luggage and put it on the plane. Yes, sir. Don't mind. You fill in the names. That'll make it even more efficient. In the names of Mr. and Mrs. Victor Lazlo. Why my name, Richard? Because you're getting on that plane. What about you? I'm staying here with him until the plane gets safely away. No, Richard. You said I was to do the thinking for both of us. You're getting on that plane with Victor where you belong. But, Richard, no, I... Inside of us, we both know you belong with Victor. If that plane leaves the ground and you're not with him, you regret it. Maybe not today, maybe not tomorrow, but soon, for the rest of your life. But what about us? You'll always have parents. Those are no good at being noble. It doesn't take much to see that the problems of three little people don't amount to a hill of beans in this crazy world. This is our hill. And these are our beans. He's looking at you, kid. Victor Laszlo is on that plane. 
get away from that phone. I would advise you not to interfere. I was willing to shoot Captain Rano, and I'm willing to shoot you. Shut up. Put that phone down. Get me the radio fire. Put it down. Major Strauss has been shot. Round up the usual suspects. Might be a good idea for you to disappear from Casablanca for a while. Mm -hmm. Louis, I think this is the beginning of a beautiful friendship. <laughs> I have no conviction, if that's what you mean. I blow with the wind. I'm shocked, shocked to find that gambling is going on in here. You're winning, sir. Oh, thank you very much. Remember, this gun is pointed right at your heart. That is my least vulnerable spot.